Dudes, what is up? Welcome back to another video. So these fish that you're about to watch me catch, I actually caught three or four weeks ago on my trip down to the South Island. Uh, I should have put them all in one video, but for some reason they slipped through the cracks. Some from the first day, some from the second day, and I just didn't have enough storytelling to put it all together in one cohesive video. So I'm gonna come to you sort of in between some of this stuff and fill you in. It's also the perfect opportunity to talk to you guys about some things that I wanna do, some things. Uh, what's the word for it? I don't know what the word is for it, but some things you guys can do to help help me out, help the channel out. And uh, yeah, so we'll get to those shortly. But first, let's show you the first fish. <laughs> this is a nice big rainbow so cool so happy all right so that was a really nice good condition i think it was a hen was it and that fish was caught the first day late morning right before a big rain squall came through we spent about an hour after catching this fish hiding under an awning from all the rain um, but a really nice fish one thing that i i'm really bad at in my videos is letting you know letting you guys know or showing you what sort of uh you know what i'm using but if you're if you're familiar at all with some of the videos that i have shown it it's exactly the same rig as i use on like the tonka or all the stuff for winter fishing 10 to 12 foot leader a big heavy fly and an egg maybe some split shot we did catch a couple of these fish on smaller naturals as well but that's pretty much the go-to all right so the first thing i want to talk to you guys about is patreon i am going to launch patreon of held off doing this for five years i actually built my patreon over two years ago it's been sitting there um and i've never launched it because just because i don't like the idea of asking you guys for money or it just a, anyway in the light of conditions and stuff like that the six thousand dollar camera without i just brought a new drone multiple gopros over the years it does cost a lot and then if i want to make good trips and stuff this year with fuel being so crazy uh stuff like patreon or or a, a program like patreon would really help out so nothing on the main channel is going to change it all remains exactly the same in fact it should only get better so there'll be a couple of different levels or tiers inside the patreon if you go check it out you can see i have pretty limited time to run a patreon and a youtube channel as well i work full time i have a family all that kind of stuff i'm going to have to figure it out as i go along but um check it out it'll be linked in the description if you can support the channel in any way that'd be much appreciated let's watch another fish and then I will get back to you with the next thing. So this fish here, uh, I was sitting on the bank talking to James from the Angler's Logbook. He's got some amazing footage from this trip. His channel will be linked below. So I was sitting on the bank talking to him about cameras and Lance was out in front of us. And sorry, I keep looking at the monitor over here, but you guys are in there, I apologize. Anyway, Lance is out in front of us. He hooks up on a really nice fish. And uh, yeah, let's check it out. Come around there. Well, micro four thirds. Oh, Yo. Oh, oh, Lance is in. Yeah, I think they're just having a bit of a harder time. You got to get it right in their nose, otherwise they can't see it. It's probably like a milkshake down there. Good job, buddy. Well done, man. 
Wind, wind, wind. Yeah, well, that's in a better size category condition to be like the strongest one. Yeah, 12 or something, maybe. She's a ripper. Mm. Can't go that way. What a beautiful looking fish. Stunning. Sweet. Shit, sorry man. <laughs> <Go on. laughs> All right, so that was a really nice uh, fish that Lance caught there. I went to get my camera and as I was coming back, I uh, nearly pushed James and, and then the fish went away. So not ideal, but still a really cool fish worth showing you guys, I reckon. So let's just get the rest of this done and then I'll just show you the fish. Um, there is some other ways that you can help support the channel, so there's going to be a few different ways. So I'm probably going to forget them, I should have written them down, but obviously there's a Patreon that we've already spoke about. The other way is I'm going to launch, what's it called on YouTube? So memberships on YouTube, you can become a member directly on, on YouTube itself, works very similar to Patreon. So there's also this thing on YouTube called Supers or Super Thanks. This is a way if you see a video that you really, really liked or something in it that you really, really enjoyed and felt like maybe it's worthy of uh, some monetary compensation, you can use a thing called Super Thanks. Some people have already done this and YouTube has done a really poor job of showing me um, who did it and when. So I, I, I do earn some money off YouTube, ad revenue, I'm sure all you guys know that. But I was checking it one day and I had this other revenue from Super Thanks. And so some people had already used that feature and I didn't, YouTube didn't even let me know about it. So I feel really bad about that, that I couldn't reach out to those people directly and, um, and, and thank them for thanking me. Um, but if, if, if you guys want to do that in the future, then I will certainly make it a priority to get back to you guys that use that super thanks function. The other way which might work quite well is I'm going to link my PayPal in the description. This is probably going to work best if, uh, or similar to super thanks, if you think there's something really worthy of, you know, thanking me for or something, I don't know. Or you just kind of want to make a one-off donation to help me with fuel or whatever, get to that next spot so I can make another video. Um, that's a way that you could do that, PayPal. So that's, I think, four ways. Patreon, memberships, super thanks, PayPal. There's probably another one that I've forgotten about, but I'll let you guys know in the future, you know. And I'll probably remind you guys about this in some of the videos um, going forward. Um, but that gets that out of the way. If you do choose to take me up on one of these things, supporting me financially, supporting the channel financially, helping me get more places, do more things, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I, I'm fairly lucky to be in the position I am. You know, I don't do this full time. I do have a job. I, I work full time. I have family. But I do get to earn a little bit of money from doing what I love to do and sharing it with you guys. So anybody that does any of these things, thank you so much. I really do, 100%. I really do appreciate it. Uh, the support is amazing. All right, that gets it out of the way, I'm pretty sure. Uh, so let's just get back into these last two fish, uh, which are really, really spectacular fish. All right, let's do it. Yeah, fish on. Beautiful fish. Woo -hoo -hoo. And that water's so milky. I mean, it's decent. Oh, it's pretty good. Real pretty side on it. What's that? Yeah. She's given up pretty quick. Easy fight because she's got no tail. Boom, cheers bro. 
appreciate that. Man, that is a fucking beautiful fish. Yeah, real nice spots and just pretty. The tail's a bit gone on her, but apart from that, she is beauty. Wow. Oh, spots are incredible. <laughs> yeah. Wow. It's gorgeous. Okay. First fish of the second First fish of the second season. Oh, this is gonna bug everybody at home. Another line wrap. That guy was quite upset. Big dog. Woo! Speechless, really. Not much to say. Other than that's pretty fun. Alright, you want to go? See you, girlfriend. Anyway, so a bit of a different video. Turns out there was five fish in there instead of four, uh, unless I can't count properly, but I'm pretty sure there was five. A little bit uh, disappointed that I didn't get them all into the first video and made it way better. I don't know, when I fish water like that, I just get super excited and uh, it's really, really, it's really hard to film anything other than just put the GoPro on and go try to catch fish. I still am first and foremost a fisherman, but I love filmmaking, I love, trying to tell a story i love doing this sort of thing as well but uh on day on mornings like that when there's big fish around and, uh, it's pretty hard pretty hard not to just go fishing but anyway that's it that's all thank you guys so much for watching if you choose to support me or support the channel through any of the things i've mentioned in this video thank you so much i i can't I, it's very hard for me to describe or tell you how much i appreciate if any of you choose to take me up on what i've told you today that's it until next time thank you so much for watching like subscribe comment do all that good stuff and i'll catch all of you in the next video peace